Hey guys, Crewman here, and I normally don't do videos for single articles, but this one is a doozy. According to videocards.com, the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 5090 d for China has limits on AI use and crypto mining. This isn't our first round of LHR, but according to this article, they're doing some different things. So the first thing that is going to happen to lock these cards down is they're going to have a three second cutoff limit after that performance is locked if they can detect ai inference or crypto mining that one seems like a little eh, i don't know how they're going to pull that one off i'll be interested to see but the one that's really really going to hurt uh as you can see right here nvidia has restricted power limit changes so if they're going to basically make it where you can't undervolt the 5090d that's going to kill it for mining because there is no easier way to kill a product for mining than to make it inefficient. And if it's inefficient, it's going to be dead, especially considering the performance is close to the 170HX. And if you kill its efficiency, why would you spend $2,000 on a GPU when you could get a 170HX for, I think they're going for like 400 something right now. Another interesting thing they also shared in the article they are claiming the 5090d cannot be used in multi gpu configurations which will kill it in a crypto mining rig maybe not like a warthog rig but basically for every other form of crypto mining it'll kill it and it'll kill it for ai too people are going to say well crew man this isn't the first time we've had lhr and it'll just be hacked if you look at the lhr that we saw on the 30 series at the end you know like towards 20 i think it was like the end of 2021 those things didn't get cracked until NVIDIA let you crack them right after the ETH merge, right when they realized it didn't matter anymore. That's when they released an updated BIOS. Those things were never cracked. Or if they were cracked, it was never shared publicly, which is the same thing as it being locked for most miners anyway. Then you got to remember the 3060, the original one, the only reason that was cracked was because NVIDIA did it themselves. The second, when they released the version two, that wasn't really, that wasn't ever cracked. And to get version one working anyway required so many hoops you had to jump through. It almost wasn't worth it, guys. So what I'm trying to say is, guys, I think that this thing is going to be pretty locked down. And that may put even more pressure on, on the American market for 5090s. Because you got to figure that people are going to be getting these things. And somehow they're going to find their way to China. I don't know how. But these things tend to always happen. But it also leads me to another question. Do you think NVIDIA is going to put these locks in on the 50 series? If there's a supply issue with the 5090s, are they going to release an, an LHR version similar to what they're doing with the 5090D where they're going to kill the 5090 for mining and AI? I certainly hope not, but you never know, especially if you know what I said is true where nobody's going to be able to get these things and the price is going to go through the roof. People are just going to get mad. So I, I don't know, guys, what do you think? Do you think they're going to put this in or do you think this is just for the 5090D so that NVIDIA pleases the American government? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Also, are you going to still buy a 5090 for crypto mining knowing that maybe this could happen in the future? Like, are you going to rush to buy one now? Are you going to wait? What are you going to do? Let me know in the comments down below. Like I said, for me, I still think I'm going to try to get one for mining and that's it. But I'm mostly team 170HX here. So just interesting times we live in. You know, we're still kind of waiting for crypto to do something after that, you know, initial excitement of the election. So hopefully when the new administration comes in, we see some kind of pump in the markets because it's just like do something. Anyway, guys, let me know what you're thinking down below and let me know your thoughts on the 5090. This is going to be an interesting next few weeks. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe for more crypto mining news, crypto mining GPU content, etc. on the newly rebranded Crew Man Mining Channel. All right, guys, peace out.